Welcome in all my friends. Lazy Retired Granny here. Today is Saturday, March 30th, 2024. The time is 8.20 a.m. here in Blue Sky. Sun is out, Salem, Oregon. I am continuing on my journey on Diamond Art Club's Anticipation of the Day Ahead by Chuck Penson. Square drills, it's a 36.6 inches by 27.6 inches or 93 by 70 centimeters. And it has 59 colors, four ABs, which stands for Aurora Borealis, which are drills with a special effect coated on them. And they're great for creating extra shimmering effects on the diamond painting. So I have moved over, now I'm doing this big section. So I did finish um, this over here and the one animal, which I think is a cow. Um, so let me get my picture out here. So yeah, I finished this part. So now I'm moving over this way. So it looks like I'm gonna get some more animals in here pretty darn soon. Alrighty then, so let's put that over there, and I have my caffeinated breakfast blend coffee beside me with French vanilla creamer, and once again, we have underneath the candle lamp, the warm cookies, still on the first wax melt, this is lasting forever. So, yeah, I might have to change that up a bit here eventually. I want to welcome in all of my new friends. Oh, my goodness gracious. You guys just uh, are really making me happy, happy, happy. So, if you have not hit the friend button or what it's known on YouTube is uh, subscribe, I'd love for, to have you as a friend. And make sure that you give it thumbs up if you like the video. Okay. Um, and then, of course, hit the notification bell if you want to see videos that I do in the future. All right. So, I am working on color 45. <clears throat> and color 45 is... Three, three, four, six, which is, I should have it memorized, but of course, you know, my memory banks are full. Three, three, four, six. Hunter Green. And it looks like a Hunter Green. Very nice. Okay, which... I already forgot. What is the symbol? Three, three, four, six. When did I say color 45? Oh, yeah. The down arrow. All right. So we are off and running. I did do some diamond painting while chatting with a friend on the phone last night so yeah I got quite a bit done we we like to uh diamond paint together over the phone <laughs> oh my goodness gracious such fun so yeah I slept in this morning till about I don't know four four thirty So I'm a little bit behind, and then V did a live, so um, I didn't want to start a whip and chat until that was done. And what else did I do today? Yeah, I don't know. But I do know one thing I'm going to be doing this morning while this is uploading. The sun is just, you know, streaming in through the sliding glass door, and there's all kinds of uh, nose prints, slobber, 
on the uh, sliding glass door, which is from about, I don't know, three feet, four feet down. <laughs> and it's not for me. <laughs> so, yeah, I didn't even notice that until the sun came shining through. So, yeah, I'm going to get that done this morning while the sun is still in the east. I think it's supposed to be about 67 degrees today. Yeah, that'll put smiles on our faces. The lawn is still damp from, I can see it glistening with water. So, but it does not need to be mowed today. Yahoo! So yeah, yay for me. But I am gonna, my big plan for today, besides washing the sliding glass door, I am going to do a couple unboxing videos from Dreamer and get those scheduled out for Saturdays. I always scheduled mine for Saturday. And I'm also going to do a video for tomorrow on something else. And so look forward to that. And then, what else am I going to do today? I need to go in and do some more videos from my Facebook page and get those transferred over. Those are my Ellie videos. I did some yesterday, but I guess I was overworking all that and it's didn't want to do anymore so I thought ah but you know if I work on it a couple hours a day and get those uh, edited over yeah then I'll be ahead of the game because I only schedule them for one a day Busy, busy, busy. And it looks like they're not going to give us our social security checks until Monday, so I won't be going any place until Monday. <clears throat> so I guess that's the day I'll be paying my bills and getting my running around done. Usually they give it to us by the end of the month, but I guess they're changing it up this time. That's okay. I've got other things to keep me busy <laughs> rather than do the adulting thing and pay bills. <laughs> yeah, Ellie's liking this sunshine this morning. She's been out several times sitting in that sunshine, getting her vitamin D. It's still on the cool side. I did open the door because I had a 
false sense of summertime. <coughs> oh, excuse me. And within about one minute, it's like, oh, I'm cold. Yeah, because it's still cold outside. You see that sunshine, you expect it to be nice and warm out there. Just sitting out there is fine, but you keep the door open and, oh, I want warmth. I'm going to try to get a lot done today. You know me. I if I have to be out and about. That just throws me off for the day. So I feel like I'm behind. <laughs> but I may have to go to the store because I do need some bread. I think that's all that I really need. So. I could probably live without it. Until Monday to tell you the truth. See, already I'm talking myself out of going out and about. I am just have really been on a sandwich kick lately. I don't know what it is. Why my body is saying, you need a sandwich. Last night for dinner, I had Campbell's vegetable beef soup and a sandwich. Yeah, I had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with it. Oh. Yeah, I know. That probably wasn't the healthiest thing, but... That's okay. We're getting into, um, let's see, probably the end of May, <clears throat> first of June. Yeah, we get into that season of all the fruits coming alive. So I'll be eating lots of fruits for the summer. I like strawberries, oh, cherries, blackberries. Oh, I love blackberries. Grapes. Um, watermelon. Let's see, what else do I like? I do not really care for blueberries. Yeah. Yeah, blueberries and they just uh, are not friends. Boy, there's a lot of these green in here. I'll probably 
be on these the whole whip and chat. Uh, it is really getting warm in here with that sun beating down. The next section over here, look at, I get into the barn finally. <laughs> I've been looking forward to that. Hopefully, I'm hoping that I can start the barn um, this weekend, but we'll see, because Monday is April 1st, and you know what that means. I do my monthly canvas, my monthly canvases are from Tiny Fun. It was a 12 pack, so I do one a month. I don't even know what the next one is. Let's take a sneak peek. I haven't even looked. It's just whatever's next on the stack here. Let's see if I can. it out without dropping everything here. What's going on? Come on. So why doesn't this want to sit up? It doesn't want to cooperate with me. It's my screen that doesn't want to cooperate. All right, maybe it's going to now. And then the next one, let me get this one out too, as long as I'm here. Hopefully that doesn't fall. Okay, <clears throat> so we have our fourth panel. And you really can't see too much, but that's the fourth panel, so I'll be doing that. It's a 14 by 30 centimeters. Oh, this is panel one. You know what, I should have started at panel one. I didn't even notice that till right now. And then our tiny fun, 30 by 40 centimeters. Okay, so the moon looks okay this time. So I don't know if you can tell it or not, but it's got lots of purple. And then blue, and it looks like um, three tens over there. Yep. So, yeah, we'll have that Monday. Starting those. There we go. And then I get back to this. projects to do, huh? I love doing the monthly 
ones. Just my thing. There's quite a few people that do those. There's a monthly painting they do. I think probably what I'm going to do for next year, because I don't think I have any more 12 packs, but um, I will probably just grab from, a, I think I've got a bunch of six packs in there, so I can just do two six packs is probably what I'll do. These clumping together for some reason. Let me get my declumper out. Ugh. If I can find it, wait, oh, there it is. Ugh. Crash, boom, bang. brain was playing tricks on me. Okay. And we're off and running again. Maybe I'll do a walk with Ellie today. She'd probably like that. We'll see if it warms up a bit. <clears throat> okay. Need to do a refill. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Does anybody have any plans for Easter? I don't, but... All my grandkids are older now, so... You know, it's not like we have Easter egg hunts and... All that. Coffee time. So my son, he got his old car that he's going to be selling. Um, he took it down last night and steam cleaned under the hood and the car and he did a few other things so he is listing it today or maybe he did it last night I don't know um, so maybe he'll sell that this weekend And hopefully he gets <clears throat> a good price for it. 
what he's wanting. And then he got his new car back. They were doing a few things to it. And uh, yeah, so he got it back yesterday. He's uh, got that marked off his task list. He's glad to have his new car back. He was in a rental. And yeah, so that's good. I really need to get out and deep clean the inside of my car. I usually do it like in April. It gets a, a good, good cleaning on the inside. Well, as good as I can do. It gives me a little bit of exercise <clears throat> cleaning and vacuuming and yeah and you know my car isn't filthy but um Lots of dog hair. You know, and dust, just general stuff of living out here in the boonies. Because we live in farmland, you know, there we get a lot of dust. Not as bad as where we used to live down the road. Oh my gosh, that was awful. Because the a farmer there, he had land on both sides of us and he'd get his big tractors out there and, you know, had to dig up the dirt and all that. Oh my gosh. The dirt would just go flying. And of course, you know, you get out there, you wash your car. And no more get all that done. And he was back out there again. <laughs> and the car would be all dirty again. <laughs> But here, um, if I remember right, they, I think they plow the cherry orchard, is that right before cherry season or right after cherry season? I can't remember. But it's actually not very bad, so, yeah, not as bad as before. So as soon as cherry season starts, so when the signs are out, we can go pick <clears throat> cherries and... Farmer Glenn lets us have the first two rows. So it's like in biblical days, their property or their fields 
the first couple rows were for the poor people to come and glean off of. And yeah. So that's what Farmer Glenn does. He lets us have all those that we want. And actually, even one row would be plenty for us. Um, so, <clears throat> anyway, we go out. I just pick enough for one day and then eat those. And then, you know, I can go out the next day and get more if I want. That's pretty nice. And then I'm not an apple eater, so we have apple trees. And we have pear trees. But I didn't, I have never picked the pears. Maybe I'll try that this year. I'll see how that... They're a different kind of a pear. And I went out one time, but I don't know. I can't remember what kind of pear they are. I didn't even know there were different kinds of pears, but there is. But I don't know. Maybe you're supposed to pick the pears when they're still really hard, not when they're soft. And then I think you're supposed to bring them in and let, let, let them soften up and ripen the rest of the way. If I remember right, somebody told me that. I am not a farm girl. I just, you know, go to the store and get everything. <laughs> My son next door, he were, he had the house. Um, he had a big garden. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that was good. You know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and fill the 45 here. And what color is that? 3346. I'm going to see what... These are all my four numbers. They go here, and then all my triple numbers go in this little bag. All right, so I need to open up.
tape on the back of that. And we'll add it to our little collection here. Okay, that is done and dusted. So I think our next one is the two dots. <clears throat> which is 15, 434, light brown. And we've got here, Good. Ah, I got an itchy, itchy palm. What does that mean? Coffee time. Shake those up. And we're off and running again. You know, actually, I need oh man, Has something bite me. This is itchy. I'm gonna get my mat out here. So what else happened yesterday? What did I do? Yesterday was Friday. I took a nap. Oh, yesterday. Oh my gosh. So I'm knitting away, knitting away, and all of a sudden I get to the end and my count's off. Ugh. So I had to take out all my knitting. And I found where I was off and then I was gonna watch TV and my Roku wouldn't work I couldn't figure out what was going on now all this happened at the same time I'm getting frustrated and so I I just got my Chromebook and hooked up my speakers to it and watched TV that way while I was knitting and then my eyes got heavy and I went to sleep and then I woke up and my son came over and was trying to help me with the TV and for some reason I have ghosts. And the ghosts come in, and I swear, they play with my controllers because, you know what? I don't even touch any of that. The settings and all that. I know better. Um, because I will mess up my TV every single time. And then my son has to come over, and he'll say, What did you get into this time that you shouldn't have? <laughs> so he couldn't figure out what was going on and he said well maybe I need to reset the router and so he did that and it still wasn't working and but he had to go back to work so I went into my TV settings and come to find out 
for some reason, it decided to connect to my son's internet upstairs. And of course, you know, no signal. And then it decided it wanted to um, do something else. I, I can't remember now. That, that was yesterday. So I got that all fixed and it worked. So I don't know what was going on, what the ghosts were wanting to watch, uh, but and then I yeah, I got my knitting thing back on track and you know, everything was good again. <laughs> So, that, then I left that behind, and I was diamond painting. I think my diamond painting went okay. Um, I didn't lay any drills down wrong last night, thank goodness. Ugh. Yeah, the day before I did. That was a little irritating. Got some more dots over here. I get really frustrated when things go crazy pants. And usually, I mean, it's just very brief, you know, and then life goes on. But, I don't know, my brain just... can't handle that. All right, is that all the dots? I thought I had more dots than that. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess now we'll do the lines again. I know we did lines yesterday. What was that color? 19. Four seventy. Light avocado green. Boy, that, that baby is full. Well, at least with the sun coming down, yeah, that means money from the sun. Get those credits filled up for March because they restart on April 1st, so I don't think we had any built up, but we used them all, but we still get credits um, if it's sunny. But if you had credits that you did not use, then you lose them because they reset everything. So. You know what? I 
forgot <clears throat> to go on the dreamer site this morning and see what new stuff they had. Let's see. Let us see what they have. I wish they had a um, button where you could press that says restock. All right, new arrivals. Nope, 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 nope. I don't see anything there that floats my boat. I already have the palace. Uh, I wonder if these are restocks in here. Because they're saying new. Boy V, lots of unicorns in here. Wow. Yeah, they got a lot of, I wonder if these are restocks. This is sold out. That Garden Wolf, um, it's sold out. That's, that's cute. Um, not anything I would buy, but it's really cute. Um, OB, Unicorn Forest, low stock. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Let's see. No, nope, I just don't see anything that I need that I don't have. I have enough to keep me busy for a while anyway, so. There's a lot of paintings in here, you know, that are really pretty, but for, I just don't want to do them because of the color mix on them. I just like more color. Um, like this, um, oh, where is it? I really like this Nikki Bolme card. She's my favorite artist. Um, parents pray, children play. I really like that, but it's a lot of whitish because it's snow. I mean, the church and the people and the horses and you know, it's it's got color, but it, I don't know. For me, I just need a little bit more coloring to it, I'm sure. But it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful painting. It might be okay, but, you know, anyway, I got to get out of there. Um... Yeah, so, oh my goodness. How long have I been on here? Oh, we're reaching 50 minutes already, and I've just been rambling on. All right, I'm going to let you go. Thanks for stopping by, though, and visiting with me. I do appreciate that. And like I said, if you haven't pressed the friend button or that subscribe button, um, be, do that. I'd love to have you as a friend, and I love all the comments. So thanks for leaving those and uh, letting me know what you're doing or which, you know, just what you're up to, you know, just give me some chit chat. And uh, if you like this video, yep, give it that old thumbs up. 
So, yeah, thanks for stopping by, and I will chat with you later.